Welcome to your Daily Double Reading. Today we will be using the Spirit of the Animals Oracle Mini along with the Fountain Tarot Mini to get you two card combos to choose from for your message. So we are going to start with the animal deck here first. So you can start by asking your intuition which one of these combos is going to provide me with the animal that's going to give me the message that I need. One or two, this or that energy is what you're asking your intuition. So one of these two animals, which one am I guided to or connected to or leaning toward? And let's add the tarot now to make them combos. <laughs> okay, I guess this one definitely wants to be out. Thank you. And let me set those for you. Okay, card combo one or card combo two. Once you have allowed your intuition to direct you to one or two, you can head down to the description and click on the timestamp next to the card combo that you've chosen. And I'll see you in your daily double reading. Hello group one and welcome to your daily double today. If you're listening to this, you've chosen the first card combo here for your animal message. So let's see which animal you have chosen first. Ooh, the sea turtle, lovely. And protection. You are master of finding life's flow. Be in harmony with the rhythm and your path will unfold. Persevere and you will succeed. You have everything you need to be protected and happy. Oh, a sea turtle energy, that is the epitome of it. It's about feeling at home, feeling protected. That's why they have that beautiful shell that is their home. And if any kind of danger pops up, they can just whoop, scoop back into the shell. And then of course, flowing with the current of life. So the sea turtle is coming in to remind you that you have everything you need. You can persevere here. You have everything you need to be able to move forward and flow with, uh, they're saying like life's changes or life's up, ups and downs. Um, if things are kind of topsy-turvy today, or if they feel like they're all over the place, or maybe you're facing some scattered energy or a little bit of a frustrating situation, or maybe there's a challenge, or you know, your mind is kind of overactive, uh, the sea turtle comes in to help you kind of form that bubble of protection around you to, to remember that you can be at home in yourself, that you do have everything you need to stay grounded and safe and secure, and it's okay to trust the flow that is happening, even if your mind's like, what is happening right now? The sea turtle coming in for this group is telling you, you've got what you need to move through it, and you are protected. You have everything you need to be protected and happy. Let's see what's connected here. The nine of wands. Okay, so kind of double message here. Again, if you've been um, facing like a challenging situation, if you have been uh, having an overactive mind, uh, a nine of wands is about perseverance. It's about being just right there, like you're almost to the finish line. If you've been working on something for a while or if you've been carrying something for a while, it, it may have been hard. You may be putting your time, energy, and effort into it. The nine of wands says, don't quit before the finish line. You are just about there. And with a sea turtle to couple it, today it's about flowing with it, trusting that you're doing everything you can do and that's all that spirit is asking of you. You can persevere in this situation you are strong enough. This is leading to happiness. You're going to succeed, right? That's the whole energy here. It's really doubling down on the message of perseverance 
standing strong and knowing that all of you, the work that you've been putting in is leading to somewhere beautiful. And very soon you're going to get to that finish line and look back and go like, oh, this was worth it. So I hope that this serves you for the day. And if you enjoyed this reading and you don't want to miss any of my future readings, I would really appreciate it if you would like this video, share it with somebody who you think would also benefit from uh, pulling and choosing their daily double. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel and feel free to leave me a comment down below or a turtle emoji to let me know that this is the card combo that you chose. And I will see you in your next daily double. Hello group two and welcome to your daily double reading today. If you are listening to this, then you have chosen the second card combo here with your animal guidance. So let's take a look at the animal you've chosen first. Ooh, the black bear and guardian. Mm, mm. Gentle and wise protector, give me your confidence and power. Help me protect the ones I love. Awaken my intuition and guide me. Ooh. So a couple of messages here. Guardian energy is like um, guardian angels, of course. Angels come up. And then... Um, guides that are protection guides. So guides that are there to um, protect your energy, of course, to guard what's coming in or what's going out. Uh, they're called gatekeeper guides. And so you may very well be working with some sort of guardian angel, someone on your spirit team, uh, could be a crossed over loved one that you feel is guiding you and guarding, you know, your, your energetic sphere, guarding your path, a gatekeeper of, of sorts that is protecting you and making sure that nothing infiltrates that beautiful energy of yours. Um, also, this is about really establishing uh, your core energy and your core power back to yourself. If you feel like you are in charge or responsible um, for other people or, you know, a certain group or that you just need a little extra guidance on your path, just know that you are being guided, right? Uh, this is a call to opening up your intuition, awakening your intuition, as the card says, opening up that intuitive channel for yourself and allowing yourself to be guided by the guardians. And so I wouldn't be surprised if you do intentionally open up that channel for yourself today, that you're going to feel this warm, <laughs> um, loving, protective energy energy pointing you in the right direction. So keep your, you know, antennas up for signs and messages and just that feeling of like safety and security and that you are being guided by the divine because we all are all the time. Let's see what we have connected to this card for you. Ooh, the justice energy. I love this. Okay. Justice card is a major arcana card that says everything is balancing out. Everything is okay. The justice card is a card of truth. It's a card that says uh, things are going to be fair in this. So if you are looking for a path of truth or if you are looking for the truth in a situation, the guardian energy is going to show you that, right? With this kind of a combo. Um, also, stepping into your confidence with a justice energy or stepping into your true power with a justice energy is number one, stepping into your own truth, your power of truth. So what is true for you? Are you walking that path? Do you need to make adjustments or arrangements? They're saying arrangements to be able to hop back onto that path of truth. It also is about fighting for fairness, standing up for people or situations, or, you know, maybe there is something that has been um, out of whack in your life or in your relationships or, you know, a certain area of life that you feel like, you know, I really need to step into my confidence and power and stand up for myself here. This card tells you to do that because what happens when you do that and you like tell the truth or you stand in your power, um, you know, justice prevails there. The truth ends up leading you forward into a space where you do feel more powerful and it is the right thing to do, right? Like justice, fairness, energy. So if there's something that you do feel like you need to speak up about or you need to uh, step into the truth about or you do need to stand up for yourself with or for someone else, uh, this energy would tell you that it's safe for you to do that and you are protected and guided in doing that today. So I hope that this serves you for the day forward. If you enjoyed this reading and you don't want to miss any of my future readings, then please like this video. Uh, make sure you share it with someone who you think would benefit from pulling or choosing their own uh, card combo and the daily doubles. Uh, please make sure you're subscribed to the channel and feel free to leave me a message down below in the comments or send me a bear emoji or 
or um, the justice scales emoji so that I know that this is the card combo that you chose today. And I will see you in the next daily double.